Here's the electoral map from 2008 with the familiar red states for Republican John McCain and blue states for Democrat Barack Obama. It's a little misleading. It almost looks like red won. But of course, in the presidential election, state size doesn't matter. Electoral votes do. So let's make the size of each state reflect its electoral clout. Densely populated states with more electoral votes, like New Jersey, are now bigger. States with just a few electoral votes, like Wyoming, are smaller. But this map still doesn't tell us which states are important to super PACs and other outside groups. So let's scale each state based on the money coming in for presidential political ads. There are only a handful of states in this map, battleground states. In 2008, they were all blue. But let's go back to the normal map. If we recolor the states based on popular vote, mixing in more red for Republican votes, more blue for Democratic votes, things start to look a bit more purple. And of course, super PACs and similar groups spend money in the purplest of states. It looks even weirder when you size the states by the amount of money spent per voter. In Nevada, outside groups are spending nearly $6 per voting-aged adult. Next door in California, they've spent less than a cent. For folks who want to influence the election, this is the map they see. These are the United States that matter to them.